The government announced in the last budget that 2020 was going to be the year of roads. And one month into the year of roads, how are the contractors faring? I'm sure you have seen a few roads coming up. In my own area, there are a few roads that are being... Uh, asphalt overlay is being done there. But the question is, how are the contractors fair? Mr. Hamad Labi is the Vice President of the Progressive Road Contractors Association. He's joined me in the studio. Sir, good morning. Thank you very much, sir, for your time. How's your Monday going? Oh, oh, very well. Very well. Uh, yes, yes. Year of Roads. Are you in tune? We should be in tune. Are you in tune? We should be, but we are not. What's keeping you out of tune? Because um, jobs that have been done in the past, mm -hmm. for the past four years, are not being paid. The ministry have given us a payment plan. Okay. And we have waited. The payment plan hasn't manifested. Um, some payments was done. Okay. Um, from one city to 500,000 was done. Okay. Then we jump it mm. from 10 million to 120 million. Mm. The 40% that we're going to pay to the most of the contractors who actually work on the um, I would say maintenance roads mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. are not being uh, are not being paid at the road front. Why, not why not? What is the explanation? Being given well, but I don't see why uh, we should actually pay out mm. to five hundred thousand, right. then jump five hundred thousand to ten million, and then pay ten million to one hundred twenty million. That's discriminatory payments. Right. That's the way we put it. That's the way the contractors. Did, did, did the ministry explain to you why that was? The happening? ministry, the, the, the chairman. Okay, let, let me. Uh, I'm here today, okay. not as the vice president of Proca, okay. but as a rep of uh, the chairman of the chair, uh, chairman of the consortium industry. Okay. Yes. Okay. I'm here as the, um, the, the, the rep or the chairman, um, or the chairman of the chairman of consortium industry. Okay. Yeah, that's Great. Right. So, I'm asking so the, ch the, the chairman have written a letter mm. to the ministry for okay. a meeting mm. uh, on these things, and then. They haven't given the time for a meeting. I mean, mm -hmm. in this house, part of the problems that is that has been created. We need to know okay. when the monies will be paid. Uh, well, uh, I was told some uh, 20 people were paid, mm -hmm. some 40, then another 20 were paid. We don't have the evidence that these people are being okay. paid. But the majority of the contractors have not been paid. And they, these are people who actually mm. work on uh, the maintenance roads. How, how would this impact on the agenda of the year of roads that the government announced? You, you, you see, contractors in general don't like, uh, they don't take delight in working during the election year. Mm. Why not? Yeah, but because they think the election year. No, it's not just now, but from time since memorial. Time memorial, okay. time memorial. Contractor, when they come to um, uh, election year, they are very cautious with their work. But then you, you don't pay them. You don't pay them for what that was. Contractors have been, they, they, they have contractors money for four years that have not been paid. Wow. The contractor went to the bank to borrow the money to do the road. This, the roads that have been done, mm. It was, wasn't done for a particular party. Okay. The roles have been done for the nation. For the nation. So uh -huh. if somebody comes and starts saying, uh, uh, I didn't give you, my mm -hmm. uh, start saying that, uh, that is, it's wrong. But, but the, some of the road contracts were halted mm. to be audited. Yes. And then later, some have, have those ones been released for, for continuation? Of course. Okay. Of course. Even the Cocoa Project, mm. they were the ones that were actually uh, stopped. Uh, they've been released for continuation. Okay. But uh, there's a whole lot of this in there. I think Cocoa Board is working out something. Uh, recently, I, I understand Cocoa Board even stayed late mm. to try and get the money to, to pay uh, the contractors. Okay. So Cocoa Board probably doing well mm. uh, on that. You see, we lost money. If those rules have continued, would okay. I mean, Ask yourself, after the investigation, what's, what have been found? Nothing. Right. Nothing has been found. What have we saved? We haven't saved anything. What have we saved as a country? Mm -hmm. We have rather lost money. How? Yeah, because the contractor go back to the site and mm -hmm. the roads deteriorated. And <laughs> government won't add anything to it? Any, any more money to it? No, the government has to pay. Wow. Because you asked me to stop work. Okay. So the and liability now, is on exactly you. Exactly on you, okay. yes. So you have to pay. And I, I think as a country, 
uh, there are certain things that we have to take politics out of it. Mm -hmm. When it comes to uh, the nation, the um, infrastructure and things, mm -hmm. we, are, we should know that we are, we are building the nation. Is there politics in our road sector? There is politics in our road sector. How heavy is this? Very heavy in our road sector. People wouldn't like me to say that, but I will say it. Because all the contractors, mm -hmm. whatever I say here, are the views of contractors. Okay. Because almost every contractor talked to me, mm -hmm. whether small, middle, up, Right. Everybody talked to me. Mm. Even those contractors who uh, some of them think have been paid are even right. complaining. That they are not receiving payments. They have even received payment, but because the nature of the work that they do, okay. um, they complain that the money is paid them. So them. now, if you, the contractors, are complaining, what happens to your laborers and your oh, engineers yeah, they, and they, other people? They are crying. It means that there's, are, there, there's no job for them. We, there are no jobs for them. They are crying. Our workers are crying because you can't increase their salary for them. You don't even have the money to pay. You yourself, you don't have money to buy food to eat. So how much more? You see? So, so it's a problem in the industry. And then people don't want them to say, but I will say it. How do we get you to fall in line with the year of roads? Because when it was announced, Ghanaians were happy. I was happy. Mm. And I'm happy that some portions of roads in my area are being worked on. There's asphalt overlay. You see, how then, do we get you to fall in line so the, we can get good roads? You, you see, I will come to the asphalt overlay. But you see, this government, to be frank with you, uh, this year, the budget that they brought out mm. is really big, unprecedented. Right. They are done. They are done well by bringing mm. this. But is the money going to come? That's the question. You have doubts? Well, is the money going to come? Where is the money going to come from? Is the money going to come? The budget for the road sector this year is unprecedented. It hasn't happened in the, mm. in, in the government. Right. Since but, independence. Yes, yeah, since independence. But is the money going to come? That is our question. Why are you doubtful that the money would because come? The, the people, government says, I will construct people roads. Who have, I have made a location. I will release yes. the money for you to, to construct the roads. Yes, we'll then release the money. People have worked and they've not been paid. For four years, they've not been paid. People have worked for four years. You know, even between 500 to, uh, what's it called? Between 500 to 10 million, say you're going to pay them uh, 40%. Mm. That's why the 40%. They are expecting 100%. Why is the 40%? The 40% is not here. We haven't seen it. The asphaltic overlay that's presently happening in certain parts, mm. it, it is by some... some the asphaltic overlay, let me say. There's a problem with asphaltic overlay. Why? Look at the pre from previous government to right now. Okay. Okay? Look at asphaltic overlay. How long does it, that, does it last? What I've seen is very thick. Yes, but... It's Yeah, but six, how long five, six inches. does it last? Because the asphaltic overlay has actually been laid on gravel roads, not... Um, uh, um, uh, mechanically stabilized roads. It is on, on, on gravel road, not on mechanically stab stabilized roads. So we're doing something wrong. Yes. I don't think we should be doing asphalt, uh, asphalt, asphalt on, um, uh, gravel roads. Uh, on gravel roads. What should we be doing? We should be doing resealing. And uh, doing resealing. You see, we should well, find out. We should resealing. You see, the road, after some time, the roads are getting bad. Okay. You patch and reseal again. Okay. You know, reseal again with maybe 14 mm. Okay. You see, we, 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 we have a research department. The research department should come up with the, this and that. Why is it that okay. when resealing is done, it doesn't last? Then because of that, we are doing asphalt. Okay. You see, mm. you should realize that. We are, we are using 14, 14 mm. Okay. And the 14 mm does not actually um, stick together. I mean, they, 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 they don't click. Okay. okay. You see, mm. the 10 mm, if you add the 14 there, then they will bring the 10 mm. Then it will give you something like that af um, asphaltic um, surface. Mm. So when it rains, the water doesn't seep. Okay. But if you use the 14, mm. then. Um, when it rained, water the water, can, water, the uh, vehicle ran over here for some time, and the place get weak, and then that's the reason why okay. uh, portals, yes, okay. uh, yeah, that emerges. But that is the reason why we should make that. So we should be thinking about this. You, when the road is not um, um, mechanically stabilized, mm. don't put asphalt on it.
Okay, so, so just a window dressing. So let's let's move forward. Let's yeah. forward. Let's uh, fast forward the conversation. Mm. Mm. Year of roads. Yeah. You are expecting that money will be released so yeah. that you go and work. Yes. If money is not released, you won't go and work. You won't go and work. It's simple as that. If money is not released, they won't go and what work. What conversations have people this morning I had mm. on on the radio, another radio station about uh, the Legma Road. Right. Yes. And the sun is so pleased. It's all money. It's all funding. <laughs> the banks are refusing to give money to the contractors because the contractors are not paying them. You have defaulted. Because, yes. Because we are not being paid. Recently, Alpha, the contractor demonstrated and things. The Minister of Finance did something. Mm. They did something uh, through the um, Fidelity Bank. Uh, some money and okay. things were paid. Um, Minister of Finance did well on, okay. on that. But when it comes to the raw fund, mm. the raw mm. fund is the body that actually pays the contractors who are doing maintenance work. Okay. And the raw fund, to me, is not being uh, managed well. Gabriel Chedaku, uh, I'm told he's written on his social page. He says his mm. chance to an encounter with a, a perplexed source at the road ministry that uh, some cash is available, 1.6 billion Ghana cities, to pay all 240 contractors owed some 5 million uh, Ghana cities or less each by the government of Ghana, not the road fund. But here's the thing. He says we are not ready, we are ready to pay them uh, all in full, 100% of what they are owed without discount from a bank facility. They can pick up their cash today, no sweat. All they have to do is to meet the bankers and sign up, and yet they are not doing it. Only 63 have signed up. I don't understand. When was this said? Uh, this was in October. Last October, year. to remember. Yes, yes last it. year. I saw it last year. Is it is there, saw, is, is there truth to it? That, no. The contracts are big. No. If I owe somebody mm. and they owe me, okay, eh, and you said I should come for the money, when I come for the money, the money isn't there. Right. Look, the chairman have written several letters to the ministry. Okay, we went for a payment plan. The payment plan has not been fulfilled. The payment plan that was given to us by um, uh, the ministry. What did the, the payment ministry. plan look like? They were going to. What was the first payment supposed to be done? The last payment was supposed to be uh, completed in November. That will be when mm -hmm. the, video, the, the, yes. uh, the payment will be the, done? Exactly. In November. And November you're saying 80. as of January, yes. people are January. still old? Yes, they are still old. Yes, people are still old. You see, previously, mm -hmm. with all governments, like Kufuo, Atamils, Jomama, and all that, when the payment is done at the road fund, we get um, a report. Okay. It goes to the regions. Mm -hmm. So the regional manager sitting somewhere, we know that you have been paid. Right. Then he calls you, my friend, you've been paid. I want you outside. Mm. You see, but this is not happening now. What, what is happening now? Now they, nobody calls no, you. No, you don't get no, 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 You don't see anything unless probably something goes to your bank and then you have a let uh, from 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 your bank. So there's no. We are not getting. We are not getting what we should be getting. Now what? The regional managers are not getting what they should be getting. The list of payment is not coming. You said you have a problem with and how also, the road fund is being managed. Well, yes, yes. What, what are your key yes, problems? Yes, I'm sure um, um, uh, people will not, well, people in there mm. will not be, be happy, happy with, with you, me. Right. But I'm saying it. The truth is one. Yes, the Let's truth is you. one, yes. It's not being money. I mean, if it is not as if we don't get money. Okay. We, we get money. Even if it... Um, one million mm. a month. Right. Let's look at the people's certificate that have been there for long. Okay. You see, pay as it comes. The people's certificate have been there. So I came in uh, December. So uh, you pay me before you pay January. Mm. But if you pay uh, January before uh, December, and okay. then you know, people have certificate that have been from 2015, 2016. Okay. And so you are suggesting paid. they should be paid first, and then you carry it yes, forward. Yes, that's right. The first come, first serve. Okay. So when I say not being uh, managed well, this is what I mean. So, so you're suggesting that somebody who could have submitted a certificate in 2017 will be paid ahead of somebody who had a certificate. Of there course, by 2014. that is true. Yes, and if if they think I'm lying, they should we should check it. But why would that happen? Yeah, that is what is happening. Why would that happen? I don't know. It's uh, <laughs> uh, what do you call it? Uh, uh, is it uh, preferential treatment or whatever? Preferential treatment. Uh, preferential treatment or whatever. Have you bothered to ask them why that is happening? You see, 
some of us, um, when you complain, people in authority don't like it. They don't like it one bit when you complain. But they have voted for me okay. to be their vice president. Right. So I had to look at the interests of my, my, my contractors. Mm. That's my number one. Okay. I don't have to go and uh, uh, arrange with the minister and collect my money and leave my people behind. We don't do that. Once you have been, you, 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 you have been voted for, the contractor have a, um, what, what do I call it? They have confidence in you. Right. That's the reason why they voted you into power. Okay. So you should defend their interests. You should defend the contractor's interests. That's how it should be, not your personal interest. Okay, we're wrapping up the conversation. There's also an allegation that you contractors inflate the, the prices or the rates of your contracts. Mm, Is that it, true? Why that, do you do that, that? That's not true. Anybody who tells you that a contractor inflates the prices of this mm. does not understand the, the, the business. Okay. Contractors tender for projects. Okay. And when I tender, mm -hmm. it's not just me who tender for one project. Maybe right. 10 people will tender. Right. So they look at the lowest bidder. Okay. Yes. The engineer look at the lowest bidder. And then the, um, the contract is awarded to the lowest bidder. Mm. Before, it used to be 5% right. above or 5% order. But now, it is, it is not so. Okay. It's not so. Okay. So contractor can never, and I, 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 I've said this here, okay. contractor can never increase the rate of um, uh, is, uh, the, of, of mm. project, right? And you can never increase the quantities as well. Once the bid is done, is when done. the bid is done, is done. Okay, thank you very much, sir. Closing thank thoughts. You. you have. I'll give you thirty seconds. I'm mm. sure the big men are watching. You want to construct the roads, but they say there's no money. There's no money. Okay. Yeah. They are watching. Yeah. We want to <clears throat> contractors in this country want to construct the road, but we are saying there's no money. Let's pay those people between 500 to 10 million. Let's pay them. And then you see, contractor will be on site working. Mm. And yes, I, I myself will be calling the contractors mm. one by one that we should go to site. And this Ghana is for all of us. It's not for uh, any other person. So we, we as contractor, we should also assist. But we need our money. Okay, we need our money. Money is good. And Mr. Hamad Labi is the Vice President of the Progressive Road Contractors Association. He's been here on behalf of the Chairman of the larger group. And uh, he says that they, they are ready to work the year of roads, uh, but they want their money.